I recently heard this quote from one of our coaching group members named Randy Wynn, and it has to do with when you shouldn't tell your story if it's not ready. Here's the quote. We want our audiences to absorb our messages, not be worrying about whether they need to call 911. What was he referring to? He's referring to those types of stories that are so emotionally involved and, and so heavy that you haven't recovered from the issue that you're talking about. It still brings up a lot of grief, sobbing, uncontrollable crying. If you're in that emotional state, you are not ready to tell your story. Now, Randy has a humorous twist on how we should look at that message. Again, we want the people to absorb what we're hearing and not be thinking, oh my gosh, do I need to get out of the phone? Do, do I need to dial 911? This person isn't ready. I'm not making fun of the person who's going through this, by the way. It's simply uh, a lighthearted look at determining if we're ready or not to share that message. And if it's just still too heavy, we often use the phrase, don't use a stage for therapy. It's not time. The audience isn't going to benefit. It's still all about you. That's okay. Work through it. Then you're ready to tell the story when you can focus on the audience. In our next tip, I'm going to start sharing some ways that you can make money, monetize your stories. This one, first one will have to do with emails. And if you like these tips and you'd like to accelerate your learning, be sure to pick up a copy of my first book called The Book on Storytelling. It's got 52 separate tips on how you can create more effective and impactful stories. Click on the link below this video. We'll see you in the next tip.